Hi there and welcome to another video on faith and fitness and today I'm going to talk about pruning. Yes, pruning your life. Now why am I talking about pruning your life? Well because I live in this complex and the landscapers were in today and I watched as they cut down my favorite bush and I felt a little bit sad and I thought oh why are they cutting down my favorite bush? I want to see and smell the beautiful roses that it brings me again. But then I realized it's a great analogy of my own life. They need to prune the bush so that it can have these beautiful flowers, abundant flowers next spring. It's the same with my own life. What do I need to prune out of my own life so that I can have this rebirth, this new growth, this learning experience of personal development? It's just like a flower or a bush or a certain vegetables in the garden, they all need to be dug up or pruned or cut down. And it's, this, it's no different with you and I in our own minds. What do we need to declutter in our minds? What do we need to cut out all that negativity, all those thoughts that are only harming us and bringing us down? That's what we need to cut out. So we need to take a step back and look and see what we need to prune in our own lives. You've heard the saying that says, garbage in, garbage out. Well, one of my mentors, and I love him, he says, and has taught me something different. He says this, garbage in, garbage stays, garbage has babies, and there's more garbage. And I really love that saying because it's so true. The more we garbage we put into our, our bodies, the more garbage we put into our thoughts and our minds, it just stays in there until we prune or dig deep and cut it out. Get rid of the processed crap. All the stuff that the media and the social cultures that are, are harming us right now with the negativity, even on the news, doesn't matter where you go, you hear all this negative stuff that's going on with, it doesn't matter what. There's so much negativity in the world. We can become a victim to that and be, fall victim to depression so easily just because of the negativity that's flooding our minds. So what can you prune? What can you get rid of? It's time to dig deep and prune your life. And that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go and prune out some of the stuff that needs to come out. So whether it's in your house, whether it's in your closets, whether it's in your pantry, whether it's getting rid of the junk food that's harming your body, or whether it's harming your mind, like television, or reading stuff that is only hurting you, listening to gossip. There's so many ways the negativity floods our lives. So it's time to dig deep. Dig deep in the dirt and declutter. Prune. Cut out that junk out of your life. And you will see that you're gonna live a happier, healthy life. Doesn't matter what you do, when you prune, the new growth, the rebirth, the rewiring of your mind, the renewing of yourself, the renewing of your mind is going to take hold and you will be living a happier, healthy life. So have a great day pruning, okay? And I'll talk to you again real soon. If you haven't already, please click the button and subscribe to this YouTube channel so you don't miss my upcoming videos on faith and fitness. Talk to you real soon. Bye for now.